Now, this is Saracenia oreophylla, um, and there's a big giant Saracenia flava. Both are early risers. Both come up uh, before Leucophylla, Minor, Cytosina. They do come up earlier, but Oreophylla is probably the earliest one because it's uh, from northern Alabama. Uh, it tends to come up early and go uh, dormant early too. Usually by July, they're pretty much done. But so you can see it already has pictures on it. There's a flower over there. Where Saracena flava is covered in flower flowers already, but hasn't uh, sent up too many pictures yet. Soon that'll just be a forest of pictures, just like the Oreophylla. And since we're looking at the flowers, we might as well go over that really quickly. So, flava means yellow. Mostly that's for the flowers. Even the red ones have yellow flowers. Occasionally the darkest of red clones will have a little bit of orange in them, which some would say is some regression a million years ago. It's some leucophila probably. Also, the petals are way longer. You can see how they hang down like that compared to an oreophila flower, which is right here. The whole, um, the whole look of the flower is just more squat and kind of like uh, saucer shaped and it's much more green than yellow. I'm not sure that's coming through in the video, but it's really more green than yellow. And then in looking at the pictures, we don't have a flava picture to look at right here yet, but um, Dr. Larry Melichamp, who is um, one of the premier Saracenia experts, he recently told me this trick. He said, Damon, if it's uh, Saracenia flava, the lid will touch in the back, and if it's Oreophila, they won't touch. And that's my kind of <laughs> semi-decent impression of Larry, who I super love. We can see on the Oreophila here, they do wrap back around the lobes of the lid, but they don't touch. And on Flava, um, they almost always do. And one of the last ways to tell them apart is the Philodia. So, American pitcher plant species, Leucophila, Flava, Oreophila, they all make Philodia, which are um, non-trapping photosynthetic leaves that look like this, kind of like little deformed pitchers. And you can see this is Oreophila again. And the Philodia are kind of crescent-shaped and short. And we cut all of the Philodia off of this Flava here, so I wouldn't ripped one off from one. But that's what a Flava Philodia looks like. You can see it's much longer, kind of lanceolate, which means like spear-shaped. And so you can tell them apart from the Philodia too. And those are my best tricks for telling Saracenia flava from Saracenia oreophila.